Welcome, child, to my enchanted glade. I am Grandmother Willow, and I am going to tell you the story of Pocahontas. My good friend, Flit, will help me explain how to play along. If you'd like to play along with the story, click here. If you'd like to learn more about how to play along with the story, click here. If you'd just like to listen to me tell you the story, click here. If you want to go right to your favorite part, just click here. If you just want to play one of the games, click here. And if you're sure it's time to say goodbye, you may click here. Pocahontas lived in a village along the banks of a beautiful river in the part of America now known as Virginia. Her father, Chief Powhatan, returned one day from a long journey. My daughter. Hello, father. We have much to talk about. Oh, here we go. Coquam has asked to seek your hand in marriage. He will make a fine husband. Marry Coquam? But he's so... serious. This is the right path for you. Pocahontas felt confused. Was marrying Coquam really the right path? She came to my glade with her friends Miko and Flit to ask my advice. All around you are spirits, child. They live in the earth, the water, the sky. If you listen, they will guide you. Listen with your heart, you will understand. I hear the wind. It's saying something's coming. One day, a ship from England sailed into our river. Among the men on board was the greedy Governor Ratcliffe, who came in search of gold. I hereby claim this land for England and all its riches for me. And now, Thomas, get to work. John Smith came in search of adventure. I've been looking for a place like this all my life. Well, hello. You're a strange-looking fella. Hey! Soon, everyone knew that strangers had arrived. Chief Powhatan asked his medicine man, Kikata, to tell him more about the visitors. These are not men like us, but strange beasts. They stalk the earth like hungry wolves.
We will observe these visitors until we know their ways. The visitors stayed and began building the settlement of Jamestown. John Smith explored our green forests. Pocahontas was curious about this handsome stranger and followed him to the waterfall. No, wait! Who are you? Mdakwe, Naturas. Listen with your heart, you will understand. My name is Pocahontas. I'm John Smith. We'll show your people how to use this land properly. How can there be so much that you don't know? Wait! Pocahontas and John Smith each saw the world differently. The settlers wanted to change the land. Pocahontas and her people knew it was important to share it with all living things. We'll cut down these trees, build roads and decent houses. But to us, every creature, rock and tree has a life, a spirit and a name. The drums, they mean trouble. Please don't leave. I have to go. Chief Powhatan sent his warriors to watch the settlers. What they saw upset them. Ratcliffe had ordered his men to dig up the land. Any gold yet? Nothing but rocks and dirt, sir. Savages. Ratcliffe panicked, and the settlers shot at the warriors, hurting one of Cocoam's friends. Chief Powhatan thought that the settlers wanted to fight. Both sides prepared for war. Let's try talking to them. They do not want to talk. Savages! We'll fight them! They're not savages. They can help us. We don't have to fight them. There must be a better path. Sometimes our paths are chosen for us. We have to try talking to them. Thomas, follow him. Pocahontas and John Smith found each other in my glade. They did not know they had been followed. See? Once two sides want to fight, nothing can stop them. Maybe it's not too late to stop this. Hello, John Smith. Only when the fighting stops can you be together. Look out, John! Kokoam! Thinking Kokoam was going to hurt John Smith, Thomas shot Kokoam. Chief Powhatan's warriors blamed Smith for Kokoam's death and captured Smith. Thomas ran for help 
They're going to kill him at sunrise, Grandmother Willow. You have to stop them. You know your path, child. Now follow it. Pocahontas ran to stop her people from hurting John Smith. Ratcliffe and the settlers had already gathered, ready to go to war. Father, stop! This is where the path of hate has brought us. If you harm him, many more people will die. My daughter speaks with a wisdom beyond her years. From this day forward, if there is to be more killing, it will not start with me. Release him! Chief Powhatan's words were understood by all the people gathered except one. Radcliffe fired his gun at Powhatan, but John Smith stepped between them and was hit instead. Radcliffe was sent to England in chains. John Smith also had to return to England so his wounds could heal. Pocahontas and Chief Powhatan came to say goodbye. Pocahontas, come to England with me. My place is here, with my people. But I can't leave you. You never will. No matter what happens, I'll always be with you, forever. Pocahontas remembered John Smith for the rest of her life. The peace that Pocahontas brought between her people and the English settlers lasted for many years. Well, child, that was the story of Pocahontas and John Smith. Now, what would you like to do next? Well, child, are you sure our visit is over? Yes? I hope you will visit with me and my friends again very soon. Anna, goodbye. If you enjoyed watching this video, please leave a like and subscribe. I would very much appreciate it.